Well, hello, gentlefolk, and uh, welcome back to Let's Play Frontier Elite 2. Now, uh, just before I saved it, we uh, had arrived at Barnard Star, and we were actually going to attempt to do some trading, and actually attempt to make some money. So, uh, let's have a look what they have, have got for sale. So, uh, if I look at the, uh, the, the galaxy map, we can see there, Barnard Star. And let's see... What they have to offer for their exports so exports in synthetic meat fertilizer heavy plastics metal alloys industrial parts computers farm machinery and robots now I want to go to uh, have a look to see what uh, Sol has got to uh, looks to import so if I scroll over to the Sol system we can see that their major imports is computers and farm machineries now as we know uh, Barnard Star exports computers but we'll be fair we're probably not going to be able to afford that so uh, I'm going to have a look and see how much farm machinery is let's go back to Barnard Star just to confirm that they exported that but they did indeed so let's have a look at the stock mark well actually before we do that there are a couple of things that we actually need to do now I'm just going to land at space stations which means that I can get rid of my atmospheric shielding so that I can have a bit more weight and I can carry more things so if I go to the shipyard and I think it's upgrades <laughs> um, atmospheric there it is so if I remove that you can as I don't want no no oh yeah wrong button <laughs> atmospheric shielding remove so I've removed my atmospheric shielding so if I now look at my ship you can see that that's gone and we have one more cargo space yay so uh, we should be able to earn a bit more money so to the stock market so stock market is where you buy and sell everything so I'm going to buy one hydrogen fuel I'll, uh, should I buy two? I'm going to buy two just in case of a missed jump because that does happen and you end up anywhere so I'm going to buy two just to be on the safe side and farm machinery now unfortunately this is not in alphabetical order People are probably screaming at me going, there it is, there it is, and there it is. And it's so we can buy one. <laughs> no, but there we go. So we have bought our farm machinery, and then if we have a look at the bulletin board, we can see if there's any jobs going towards salt. So here are all the different jobs, ship required, payment of 1,100 whatever credits for this it was for passage for a small group to the Beta Hydra system, goods bought and sold at Haines and Sons Incorporated, wanted nerve gas, will pay a lot, <laughs> wanted someone for a removal job, so there's an assassination, ship required, payment of 2,475 credits for a ship to take a small package to the Lutan 1159-16 system, so if we was uh, feeling brave, <laughs> we could go there. Payment of 600 credits for passage to two people on a fast ship to the Fomalhort system. And we could give away to charity. Uh, vacancy required as a crew member on a starship. Now, we don't need any crew at the moment because we have such a small pool of ship. But once we get better ships, we're going to need people to, to man it in different positions. And that's where we'd hire the crew. So as you can see, there are lots, and here's the military jobs. Deliver some superconducting wire to beta hydro system by midnight on the 23rd of January, and the date at the moment is the 8th of January, so we would have to work out whether we get there on time. So as you can see, there are lots of different jobs that we could possibly take up. Out there. I'm just going to check. No, that's the last one. So there's nothing going to the Sol system. So I'll just 
highlight the solar system. There we go. I shall ask for launch request. And off we go to try to make our first trade and see what uh, what monies we make. Put my gear up and hit the hyperspace button. And here we are relative to the soul system. So engine is off. And the soul system. Now where should we go? Where should we go? Should we go to Earth? Let's go to Mars. Go to Mars. Out space station. Now, if you can't see this at the back, but if you right click and hold, you can actually scroll around. Believe it or not, even in those days, you had three uh, three dimensions. And there's there's Mars High, which is our destination. Look out the window. And if you're there, we go. And off we go. So let's have a look at uh, wrong button. Let's have a look at our ship. And this is our profile, and we are carrying one ton of hydro because we've used a ton to make the hyperspace jump, and two tons of farm machinery. And I can't remember what I bought it for. Is it 63 something like that? And this gauge here is our fuel gauge, which we're actually using in uh, travel at the moment so we need to keep an eye on that which is why I bought an extra fuel in case it went low and we'll up the speed as we're on our way to Mars So here we are, Mars High. There's Mars High Space Station. Look at that beauty. <laughs> Even with flashing landing lights. Excellent. So here we go. We are about to land. Hopefully I have enough money left for the fee. And we died! We crashed! <gasps> <laughs> and we crashed on the shortest let's play in the history of all let's plays. <laughs> well, what I shall do, gentle folk, is I, uh, I shall start a new episode with this uh, very, very shortly. We'll take it from where we left off. Um, I'll quickly buy the stuff again, and uh, we'll see how much we'll make in the next episode. Um, because that was just ridiculously short. But it just shows you how realistic the game is. Um, hopefully you found that fun and <laughs> not so exciting, but uh, hopefully I'll catch you again soon and thank you for watching and you take care and keep safe and farewell.